what is up everybody welcome back to real time i'm rob i'm brace and i'm the and today we are back with another movie for movie week today we are watching the devil wears prada just to fill you guys in i have seen this movie before of course actually all three of us have seen this one <laughs> yeah we've all seen it before we just wanted to watch it yeah no um <laughs> i have seen this movie before they have not oh. seen it um it's been a really, really long time. Like, I I was a little kid when I saw this movie. Did you like it? Yeah, I mean, when I was a kid, I liked it. I remember very, very little, Um, but I do know it has a great cast. Anne Hathaway, Meryl Streep, Stanley Tucci. So, oh, Stanley Tucci. Yeah, Stanley he, Tucci. I love Stanley Tucci. He's the... He's in the Hunger Games. Yeah, that was coming. Huh? <laughs> he's the uh, announcer guy. Yeah. He's really cool. Yeah, he's a great actor. Yeah, with that being said, um, I don't really know anything about this. I think... It's about fashion, right? Because Prada, I know, I know Prada. That's about it. I know, mm -hmm. uh, I like, I, I know Anne. Ha I've known Anne Hathaway for a while, but I feel like I haven't seen much things she's been in. I know she's like in the Princess Diaries, right? Mm -hmm. But I feel like I haven't seen it, anything she's in. So you're gonna uh, love Stanley Tucci, Bryce. He's okay. a really good actor. Okay, um, and I'm, ex I'm excited to see uh, Meryl Streep. She, we just watched. She was in Little Women. We just watched. Which uh, one she's is a she? super, super talented actress. So, uh, she was. Uh, their aunt that died that was with took amy to paris amy in paris all right guys so that is pretty much it before we do get into this movie um like we did say this is a movie for movie week um so there will be uh, at least a couple of the movies up on the patreon right now for early access so make sure to check that out see what we're watching for movie week but yeah before we do get into the movie make sure to check out all the links in our description the first one's going to be for our patreon we have the full uncut watch alongs over there as well as a bunch of early access for movie week as well as all the shows that we're watching right now so stop by check that out second link's going to be for our discord come talk to us about all the movies we're watching for movie week um we're in there all the time we got a super super cool community so stop by chat with us the rest of the links are going to be for all of our social medias. Give us a follow. And at the very, very bottom is the address to our P.O. box. Send us some stuff to be opened up on camera for our show mail time. And yeah, with all that being said, guys, we're going to get right into this movie. The Devil Wears Prada. Let's do it. I feel like we're going to get some 13 going on 30 vibes around here. Feel me? I definitely feel that. Andrea Sachs? Yes? Great. Human resources certainly has an odd sense of humor. Is it Emily Blunt? I don't know. I don't know, Emily Blunt. And a sack to the last two girls after only a few weeks. We need to find someone who can survive here. Do you understand? Yeah, of course. Who's Miranda? Oh my god, I will pretend you. Oh my god. No, no, no! It's wrong. She's freaking out. No, 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 no. Who's pulling up Miranda? No! She's on her way. Uh oh. There he is. And the man. Is she like trying to be the new assistant or something? Miranda's coming in. Is it gonna be Shreep? Oh, it is her. Meryl. When they say it's her position, is she, is she like the editor in chief for uh, yeah, runway? Yeah, so. I don't understand why it's so difficult to confirm the point. No, I'm so sorry, Miranda. I actually did the confirm details of your incompetence do not interest me. She's gonna like uh, yeah, Anne Hathaway's character. She is, huh? The respect this woman has. Or just the fear people have. This is a lot of information to write down. Yeah. Mm. I don't think I could do this. Mm. Oh. Uh oh. She's gonna like her. Send her in. I'm guessing, uh. Miranda is the devil in the title. Mm. My name is Kate Sachs. Andy. I recently graduated from Northwestern. Northwestern. Sheesh. <clears throat> well, I think I could do a good job as your assistant. And um runway. Uh, no. And before today you had never heard That's good, I think. I think she'll like that. It was a statement. You just don't have any. Thank you for your time. Who is that sad little creature? <laughs> a 
Oh my god. Before and after piece, I don't know about. Before and after piece. She's gonna get the job, isn't she? Probably. Andrea. Oh. Ah. Uh, you want check? That looks like Joe Jonas, dude. <laughs> Boyfriend? I think she's gonna have a, a bigger role here. <laughs> Another one bites the dust. <laughs> what time is it? I didn't get to see. Yeah, I don't know how to read this. A lot class. of coffee instructions. You don't know how to read an analog clock? <laughs> Dialogue clock, I can. Oh, oh, oh. Dialogue. <laughs> Talk to you. <ya. laughs> reason that my coffee isn't here? Has she died or something? No. I'm just wondering who all the girls at the beginning were. There were like so many girls. Yeah. Dance club. Dance club, probably. Emily. Actually, it's Andy. My name is Andy. Andrea, but uh, everybody calls me Andy. <laughs> I need 10 or 15 skirts from Count. Skirts to read. Please bore someone else with your <laughs> request. And tell Simone. Mark Jacobs. If Maggie isn't available. Did DeMarcelier confirm? I'm so lost. I can't watch. I'm getting anxiety. Uh, okay. Me either. Let's get out of here. Sit this one out, boys. I got it. Let's go. Yes. <laughs> She's going to see your shoes. <laughs> Disrespect. I feel like she's honestly treating her with more respect than some people already. <laughs> Grabs the shoes immediately. Give her two seconds. Do you have some prior commitment? Just skirts. Skirt no, no context. Just a skirt. It's like someone just saying, "Get me fifteen shorts." What do you mean? Nope, just fifteen shorts. What kind of shorts? Khakis, ball shorts, b-ball shorts, baseball shorts, football shorts. Dark I shorts. think you covered all those when you said ball yeah, shorts. What is it? <laughs> I think she has the power of God or something. Smart, crafty. <laughs> That's crazy. Um, more than any of the other silly girls. Aww. Um, I really did everything I could think of. Uh, shirts are off. No. <sighs> I want her to go off. Mmm. I think she's trying. What is it that you want me to say? Huh? Do you want me to say poor you? Miranda's picking on you. Poor you. Poor Andy. Hmm? Wake up, six. Calling her by her size is crazy. Yeah, that's really crazy. For so many people to die for work, you only deign to. And you want to know why she doesn't kiss you on the forehead and give you a gold star. He does have a bit of a point, though. Yeah. Doesn't really respect it like everyone else does. I don't know what you expect me to do. But there's nothing in this whole closet that'll fit a size six, I can guarantee you. Oh my god. Okay, now it's just a little bigger. Just a love. Yeah. He just gets all this stuff to wear? I think, I don't know. That's cool. It's giving me ASMR. We have to get to the beauty department and God knows how long that's going to take. Like just going around the closet, it's very ASMR. In the moment I saw her, she was going to be a complete and utter disaster. Oh, she's slaying. Oh, go off, queen. Looks like she's going to school. Yeah. I don't know. For the, t for the era. I guess. 
Personally, now I think she looked better before, but. I know. Mm. Why oh, did she say up. the F word? <laughs> Here we go, Rob. This guy again. Just walked right by her. Didn't recognize her. I think she looks good now. I mean, she did before. I think she looks better. Mmm. <laughs> Smooth. Oh, what are these transitions? Oh, let's go. She got good fits now. Another one? Oh! oh. Zuff is loving it. Let's go. Another one coming soon? Nope. Right here. No? We'll get one. Right Walk here? by the person. Oh, oh yep, here, right we here. here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Sure. Yeah! Oh! It's an alley oop and he dunks it! There she mm. goes. I love it. She just starts dressing and now she's like a good employee. Yeah. <laughs> Weird translation there. Excuse me. I'm looking for James Holt. Heard him right there. Oh, oh. Oh, he's good looking. Oh, let me see that back. Ah. Very, very nice. Distressed studded leather, pieced by hand, finished with a metallic finish. Very nice indeed. Who made that fantastic thing? You. <laughs> what a flex. That must be such a flex to design. Yeah. Stuff and people just wear it. Yeah. That's pretty cool. He's, he's right, you know. What? Hmm? Punch. I drank it at James's last party. I woke up. I know him too. I do too. I think he's in Rudolph. Oh, Rob, we can't be like these names. They're on the tip of my tongue. Christian Thompson. You might like every magazine I love. I actually I reviewed your collection of essays for my college newspaper. Did you mention my good looks, my color charm? Okay. No, but. What do you do? Oh, well. That was a little weird, huh? Well, I should read your stuff. Why don't you send it over? Yeah? That would be... Thank you, that would be great. Actually, right now, I'm working as Miranda Prince's assistant. Oh, you're kidding. Well, that's too bad. Never survived Miranda. Hmm. You can't do that job. Got a blast. Miranda girl. Miranda girl. Yeah, that's pretty rude. What? That was random. That guy's gonna be the villain of the movie, bro. Yeah, I think so. He's killing it. Hi, I'm Andrea. I would like you to deliver the book to my home tonight. You have Emily give me the key. Mm -hmm. Honor by her. Real name now. I like it. And she's going to the house. You know, if I can deliver the book, then that means I must have done something right. I'm not a psycho. Oh, and you know she called me Andrea? I mean, she didn't call me Emily. Isn't that great? That is good progress, at least. This chick is miserable. I'm about to tell you. Oh, okay. The book is assembled by 10, 10 and you must wait around till 8 p.m. You will be delivering Miranda's dry cleaning. And you walk across the foyer. You hang the dry cleaning in the closet across from the staircase. I feel like she's gonna fuck something up. Oh. Oh, the twins. That was a big staircase. That's like ours. You can give the book to us. It's okay. Come on. <laughs> okay, come on. Yeah, come on. It's okay. Stop talking. Uh, or you could bring the book upstairs. Emily does it all. There's no way.
Absolutely lying. They're trolls. She does not do that all the time. These are her like granddaughters or what? Ah, uh, that's not good. I'm mortified right now for her. Where are we going? <laughs> A little too confident. It shouldn't be a problem, should it? Sounds impossible. <laughs> they want an unreleased Harry Potter book. Cool. They, they want to know what happens next. Uh, no. <laughs> She's in the kitchen. It's the guy that she talked to. He told you you can't do it. An impossible job. <laughs> What's that? Oh, I don't want that. I'm having lunch with Irv. I'll be back at three. Oh. I'll have my Starbucks later. Oh, and if you don't have that Harry Potter book by then, don't even bother coming. Oh my God, <laughs> this job sucks. He got it. The monument should be erected in my honor. He didn't. Oh yes, a friend of a friend does the cover art, and she happens to have the manuscript. I feel like this guy is, this Christian guy is going to be a bad person. That's crazy. <laughs> oh man. Industrial space. Who thought the contrast between the femininity of the corals and the more raw rough female What happened to Emily? Wonderful change in you. No. Is she good? Crawls no. like tuberculosis or something. I mean that was obviously really bad to do. I feel like she's gonna have to go to this party that she's supposed to go to. Miss her boyfriend's birthday party. <laughs> that would be a bad thing to do. Hello? Before the benefit tonight, I need to make sure that you're both fully prepped. Oh. <laughs> well, she has other plans tonight. Not anymore. He looks good. He looks really good. He looks good, too. He's staring at her. I think it's his dress, right, yeah. she's wearing? You look so thin. Do I? <laughs> <laughs> This guy's a weirdo. If it weren't for the stupid boyfriend, I'd have to whisk you away right here and now. Damn. Don't like that. <laughs> stupid boyfriend. Are you sure? Because uh, my editor for New York Magazine is inside, and you know, I could introduce you to him. 
pretty large package. <laughs> but what I did read Oh, that's so funny. He should meet you. What a uh, I don't know about him. <laughs> he seems like he's nice, but then he doesn't. He's a little he's literally a sly fox. He seems a little sleazy. Ugh. This sucks. Joe Keery. That's who it is. <laughs> I kept trying to leave, but there's a lot going on. He's pissed. On his birthday. Talk about this. I'm not gonna look good either. Hmm. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Uh oh. And I want you to come with me. me the best possible time my friend could have. Let me mull it over with Emily. Oh. Emily's out. Emily would die. Her whole life is about that. <clears throat> she hasn't eaten in weeks. I do that, Miranda. I, I can't. Oh, that's brutal. A bit of a threat right there, I feel like. She's just saying, like, if she fucks up here, she'll make sure she doesn't get anything else, too. Yeah, that's pretty fucked up. Yeah. Hmm. Oh! She tosses her shit on Emily's now. The disrespect. I think Andy's number one assistant now. Oh, I feel so bad for Em. Yeah, she's not gonna handle it well. didn't have a choice. Well, we know how she is. Is that is a pathetic. Uh. You know who's going to be over there in Paris? The guy with the blonde hair who flirts with her. Christian. What's he going to do? Make a move. Okay, dude. <laughs> what? Art and sex. Lead the way. Hi. I was just thinking about it. Oh. oh come on. It's true. Paris, man. He's gonna be there, Zuff. What okay. You were gonna be there. He's circling her. Like a fucking shark. Uh oh. Right across the street. Really? Oh, wait. It's just a guy I know. Paris? Oh. Uh, yeah. Just... With this guy that just kissed me on the cheek. I thought Paris was a big deal for Emily or something. Oh, you're gonna give me a hard time, too. Don't turn it on him. <laughs> for everything lately i didn't oh, have a choice please. like this job was forced please. on me like you don't make these decisions okay. yourself you're mad because i work late all the time and because i missed your birthday i make port wine reductions all the time <laughs> i'm not exactly in the peace corps you know i wouldn't care if you were out there pole dancing all night as long as you did it with a little integrity damn you and then we can stop pretending like we have anything in common anymore Damn. You don't mean that. <laughs> no, I do. We break up? Yeah. Well, maybe this trip is coming at a good time. Maybe we should take a break. Oh. Man. Great, you're free. Oh, but 
there is the problem of the boyfriend. Blue? Just sweet, sweet, sweet. Bro. Yeah. Dude's wild, bro. I don't like him. Mm -mm. He's the type of, type of guy who would steal my girl. <laughs> Nothing I can do about it. And he'd probably say some shit like, sorry, champ, to you afterwards. Yeah. <laughs> she was very good at math. Strong. You need to go over there. See the moon. This lifestyle seems crazy. Just constantly moving. Mm. Snoop. You take his call. Steven isn't coming. Could Steven come to the airport tomorrow? Well, if you speak to him and he decides to leave things to the board. Ah, uh, getting divorced. Winters, she's the worst. And James, he's the partner. Yo, yo, he's leaving the company. She's actually gonna have a new one. For the first time in 18 years, I'm going to be able to call this. That's awesome for him. Oh my god! I'm going to actually see her. Really kind of rubbing it in her face, though, huh? Because she can't do any of this. <laughs> He deserves it. Ugh, this guy, bro. No, okay, I just wanna say she went out. Amanda does that I don't agree with. But come on, you, you hate her. Just, just admit it to me. No. She's a, she's an I don't like that she's opening up about her and he's a writer. And they're about to write about her. No one would notice anything about her except how great she is at her job. I'm sorry, I can't. I can't believe this. You're you're defending her. Yeah. It's a wide-eyed girl peddling her earnest newspaper stories. I resent that. You shouldn't be sexy. Oh. Sexy. I hate everything about this. He's just every word that comes out of his mouth is just. Ugh. Gives you the ick. Ugh. Yeah. He's a dick. That's my That's way. Your way. You're a douche. So you refer to yourself in the third person. I'm Christian Thompson. You know, I am beautiful. Uh oh. I can't resist. I just can't. Dude, doesn't care. Bro. What? Look, I, I barely know you. You're in a strange city. A lot of excuses. Thank you. No. This dude's so fucking weird, bro. Please oh, don't know she me. slept with him. Gosh dang it. Did she? And is he gone? Maybe she... he did that to try to sabotage. Yeah, he could have. I mean, I don't think he's a good person. Uh oh. Why did she sleep with him? I know, I hate it. Is it Irv Rabbits? Or. Mm. Is that the guy that is going to tell her about it? Why didn't it? she just tell her? I think that was the guy that's... The businessman, Irv. It, Irv, right? She's about to go off. Thank you, my dear friend. Morgan? <laughs> Thank you very much. Just our dear friend, James Paul. Let's go, James. James Holt. Uh, but before I talk to you about James, 
despite all his many accomplishments. I would like first to share some... Here she goes. She got a little speech. Um, recently, Martha May Cotillon has agreed to finance the expansion of the James Bolt label, transforming the work of this visionary artist into a global brand. Choose the new president of James Bond Nigel. He chose from the films the Romeo family. And with my great happiness today, he announced to you all that. I don't, why do I feel like she's not going to say Nigel? When the time is right, she'll pay me back. <laughs> you sure about that? No. But I hope for the best. see a great deal of myself wow like she's just saying all that's just for andrew to quit probably see beyond what people want and what they need even when you can like she's gonna offer a promotion i think they really did know each other and i Oof. could do something with them i mean you are all i ever dreamed of emily yep I think it's on a lesser scale. Look, that was different. I didn't have a choice. No, you chose. You chose to get ahead. Right about everything. What? I turned my back on my problems and my time got on my ass. On everything. You think she's gonna tell him about? Huh? Maybe. Did you get it? Yeah. And you're looking at them as sushi. Yo. In a weeks. Finally. Congratulations. Better gig for Nate. Yo. W man. I'm pretty sure they have bread in Boston. And they even have your Oscar. Go with them. <laughs> we might be able to figure something out. And they're back. I know this after. I get it, Seth. Herself, gonna be good saying that of all the assistants she's ever had you were by far her biggest disappointment what and uh -oh. if i don't hire you i am an idiot mm. <laughs> what a i don't even know damn if you don't hire her, you are an idiot at least she got the respect she deserves That's the smile. Oh, there it is. <laughs> All right, Devil Wears Prada. Um, that, I think that was a really good movie. Um, I really, really want to say that I liked uh, Meryl Streep. I think she did a great job yeah. as Miranda. I think she's so intimidating. Yeah, I would like every time she talked or anything, I was like anxious or I wasn't know what she was gonna say. I always knew it was gonna be bad though. <laughs> yeah, it was always bad. Even till the end, she even gave her the cold look. But she she smiled whenever. Yeah, no one could see. I her. feel like Miranda was just like so strong though. Like I, I I seriously think we only saw her vulnerable for like five seconds, and it was in the hotel room in Paris when she was talking about her divorce a little bit. Mm -hmm. Other than that, she was like stone cold, straight faced, all business all the time. Um, I just think it's crazy when people live like that. Like, yeah, I could never do that. That's what I was saying. Never like, ever live like that. That lifestyle is crazy. Obviously, it's a real job, so that's a very real thing that people. Yeah, I have so much respect for people that can yeah. do that. Just personally, I would die. No, nah, I can't do that, dude. I'm as much as I liked uh, Miranda's character and like liked Meryl Streep as Miranda, dude. What she did to Stanley Tucci was fucked. Yeah. Dude. yeah. Like, just giving him that job and then taking it away from him. Literally, his dream job that he was so excited for. He literally said that he felt free for, like, the first time in 18 years. Which, <laughs> just to take that away from someone yeah. is so cruel. It's he, just so, so cruel. He was definitely my favorite character. I, liked I really liked him as well. I liked Emily, too. <laughs> I did, too. Emily was good, yeah. I think she was a good character. Even though she was kind of snobby at first, she kind of warmed up. I think everyone We're was gonna in that industry. Uh, get the name of that boyfriend before we end the video because we were stumped about it 
Um, I really liked in the car scene there before she quit at the end how she was like compa- like saying oh, I can never do what you did to Nigel and she's like well you already did with Emily like yeah, she's like we're, we're kind of the same and it's yeah. like she's she was right about that but right when right when Andy like realized that she's like oh I kind of am like that she's like I'm mm-hmm. fucking quitting <laughs> like yeah I, I feel like um they were right when they said like you have had a choice this whole time like you're you keep saying I, I didn't have a choice I didn't have a choice but like in reality she did she could have always quit or made that decision but she always chose to stick with Miranda so to come to that realization at the end was huge for her and she gets to um move away to Boston with with Nate finally they're back together job. or yeah I guess if she gets that job um but I'm glad they're back together and now I'll open the floor for Zoff go ahead and uh let out your frustration oh yeah just the guy the worst character definitely was what was his name christian, christian. yeah he was a just slime so ball, bad, absolute dude. slime and i just think it was as, just as slimy for her to sleep with him at just after a, a really I mean, like breaking that, up that was slimy but like just the way that she behaved with him beforehand while they were still dating yeah. and like that kiss and the even like the little kiss on the cheek that um lily saw yeah that was just not cool Mm-mm. i mean she was trying to say like hey stop this and he just yeah that was a little weird yeah he just kept going. christian was a really bad character it didn't i did seem not like, like him at all she really like she was just letting him do it you know she didn't want to do it in the end yeah i just don't like how he was like well yeah i got you that book terrible. You, you owe me one he was so bad i hate i think literally the first time we saw him bryce was like i think he's gonna be the villain of yeah. this movie <laughs> he just like i don't know he looks like it but also like He's, he just has like a very he had like a very like charming personality though kind of he looked like he was right out of like a prince everything that he said just like didn't feel real it just <laughs> did not seem like <laughs> no. a real person would say that he's like do you write this shit down or like? <laughs> yeah like i said towards the beginning i think i think i said in the intro but i haven't seen much and Hath- or many in hathaway movies but i really like her i'd like to see more of them um i, I yeah, don't really a good actress yeah i don't really know too like many just, off the top of my head she but. was more popular in like the 2000s i feel yeah, like for sure um but yeah she's really awesome mm-hmm. uh, like i said at the beginning all the actors in this movie are really good they did a great job for sure yeah. all right guys well that is pretty much it for this movie if you have been liking our movie reactions and our reactions for movie week make sure to leave a like drop a comment and subscribe check out all the links in our description the first one's gonna be for our patreon we have the full uncut watch alongs over there as well as a bunch of early access for movie week as well as all the uh, shows we're currently watching so make sure to check that out Second link's gonna be for our Discord. Come talk to us about The Devil Wears Prada, as well as all the other movies we're watching for Movie Week. Uh, the rest of the links are gonna be for all of our social medias. Give us a follow. And at the very, very bottom is the address to our PO box. Send us some stuff to be open on camera for our show Mail Time. And with all that being said, guys, we will see you in the next movie for Movie Week. Peace.